So this is uh, my main hazard whenever I'm on the tractor here. Uh, Uh, I'm very popular uh, with our puppies, and um, the tractor is just a big shovel to them. And they don't realize that I can't see them when they're trying to get their ball that's underneath this back tire, you know, off to a side or something, and uh, I'm driving forward, and they drop the ball in front of the tire. So, we're going to have to uh, increase our visibility of these areas so I don't run over a dog or a duck. Actually, the ducks stay pretty far back. Muscovy, what are you doing? Yep, there we go. Did you just set that ball on the floor? Yep. Yep, we did. Maybe if Dad's foot gets... Uh, a ball delivered to it, it'll kick the ball. You know I can't kick with that foot. You silly dog. You are a silly dog. Yes, you are. So, yeah. Kind of over here looking at my trash pile. It's not all trash. Uh, that guy there is going to get sawed into uh, some halfway decent uh, wood. This is the, that's the tree. This isn't a branch, even though it's real small. This is the tree that used to be right there that fell on my fence. And uh, I bucked up quite a bit of it with my sawzall, but uh, the main trunk is, is too big. Um, I guess either I'll wait until it's so dry that I can break it with a tractor or wait for my brother to bring over a chainsaw. Um, I don't really burn wood outside. Um, but I'd like to. <laughs> uh, but a lot of this metal, especially, and the concrete, actually, this is all crap that uh, the last guy left all over the property, and so I've been collecting it. And uh, the metal's probably going to go to a scrapyard. The wood's going to get bucked up, and the concrete might get buried somewhere. If I ever have a big hole, it's all going in there. Um, and the. Uh, the PVC is actually going to get reused. Uh, I have an idea to wash off um, the inside of my chicken coop with uh, PVC because this actually isn't pipe. It's some kind of an irrigation system, kind of like a French drain, but it's quarter or quarter inch. It's a half inch, I think. Uh, so there's holes all up and down it, and I've got a really high pressure um, plumbing thing. Already ran to the uh, the goat house, which will have a chicken loft and uh, I think what I'll do is uh, cover the, the bottom of it with something like tar paper and then shingles and then I'll uh, have a timer in there that will shoot water over it twice a day or something like that and see if I can't waterproof the sides of it and it'll just wash all the chicken poop out which you know, maybe I'll uh, have a little bin to catch it and, uh, you know, something that I can move around with the forks or the bucket and I can redistribute that uh, to the yard. Although they spend a lot of time pooping in the yard anyway, so who knows? Um, I definitely think that's probably a component of why my grass is doing so, so good this year. There's a lot of birds pooping on it. And the goats are letting me know that something's going on, so I gotta go check on them. <laughs> 